It's cold air. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh. <laughs> Fucking looks mint though, eh? We've got some bloody leg work to do to get up there, cuz. We on. Alright guys, so it is the first day of of the trip. Me and uh, Chad and, and Zane have flown into the car workers. Just sorted out the hut, all the gear at the hut and all that and um Yeah, we're gonna um we split off. Just gone for a bit of a morning stalk I like. Head back to the back to the hut at about two o'clock this afternoon. And then we'll pop up onto the tops and have a look for some for some deer up there. But yeah, we're just sort of doing a little recon mission in the in the area that's around the hut. See if there's any close ones. But yeah, and then we'll um, head up there and have a crack up the top this afternoon. Try and get Chad a deer, a seeker deer. He hasn't shot a seeker before. Hunted them a few times and. In the Kaimano is, but hasn't been uh, hasn't been able to pull the trigger on one. That's the uh, aim for this trip. Try and get him a seeker. Holy shit! But yeah, so we'll um, get Karen up here, do a bit of stalking up through this little beach forest here, and uh, see what happens this afternoon up on the top. Three days. See, it's a beautiful day. Just stalk, stalking up from down in there. Sort of coming to the end of the the bush line. There's quite a bit of deer marks down coming down these these gravel bits. So I might I might go up there. Just have a look into the basin. country this, I love it, eh? So yeah, the plan is I just stalked up from down through there and just head right up up there top of there and uh look for a deer down on this basin here. Then head back to the hut at about two o'clock. Catch up with the boys. Yeah, she's 
pretty steep. Beautiful though. Carry on. Good times. What a view. This is great. Absolutely stunning countryside up here. Man. I'll head up there next. Up the top there. Well, this is freaking great. Wonder how the boys are getting on. I've gone down through that valley there. See you later on there. And then tonight we are heading where are we heading? Up to the top of that there and then down the other side. But yeah, absolutely beautiful up here. I might just sit here for a bit and just glass down through these little valleys. Hopefully I see a seeker walking around and can get a crack at it, but yeah, time will tell. Beautiful day, absolutely stunning. Tomorrow's better, Sunday's even better. So yeah, awesome. sit here and glass over those all those patches of trees down there I can see a um, game trail going across one of those slips there also that one over there so yeah just sit here and have a look around hopefully something pops out will be good Got about a, another hour before I got to meet up with the boys, so glass for a, glass here for a little bit, and then head back to the hut. See how they got on, anyway. Haven't heard any gunshots, but yeah, stick it out here for a bit, and yeah, head back. Shoot a deer, Chad. Hey. And shoot a deer. Yeah. Tomorrow's mission, mate, over that thing. <laughs> it's a good LA. Fuck you. <laughs> no, I won't lie. <laughs> good camera, mate. How you doing there, Zaino?
right guys, so just splitting off from the boys. Heading around and looking to another little bit of catch me. Put a bit of glass into there and hopefully one of us sees, sees a deer. And we'll be up here for probably maybe four hours or so. Looking around. Yeah. Plenty of land to be going over with the binos. And hopefully there's a deer somewhere out there for us. Time will tell. It's a prima afternoon. It's friggin' mint. The old cow keeps threatening to roll in. Which uh, wouldn't be ideal, but we'll see how that goes. Three days. That's what you have to deal with when you're glassing in the tops. That stuff just rolls in and in an instant. Sometimes it can stick around and sometimes it disappears that quick as well. So yeah. Good times. Might just move down there, have a look down into the actual gull gully a bit. Yeah, I will do that. How's that? We just spotted deer, or well, the boys did anyway. They're coming down to make a plan to crack at it. And all of this cloud is coming in. Of course that happened, that's freaking great. As you can see, it's pretty steep down there. Spotted one down in there somewhere. Hopefully, we see it again. They can't see it at the moment, but yeah, they're just waiting. So, we'll see how we go. Bit of a mission. Look in there. Bro, what a mission. <laughs> Not there.
Tell you what, I warmed up doing that. Cloud's not the one, eh? <laughs> Here come the brothers. There's a bit of a hike from down there. Focus, mate. That cloud's just messing with the camera. But yeah, getting there. Alright, guys. So we saw those deer. Drop down the ridge to um, get close to them so Chad could have a shot. And this is what happened. Fog rolled in and we couldn't see anything. So uh, yeah, we're about to we're just hiking out now back to the hut. We'll um yeah hike back to the hut and have a coffee, have a feed. And then yeah kick back until tomorrow morning and we, then we're back up here over the next ridge so that'll be a that'll be a nice um nice wee walk it's supposed to be clear tomorrow so no cloud hopefully it does hopefully there's no cloud anyway so yeah we will catch you guys in the a.m. three days cheers guys so back up for a hunt it's the morning the second day she's a bit a bit cloudy up here um it wasn't supposed to be like this on the forecast we're only supposed to have um 5k winds but it's easy pushing like once you get up and on the actual top there it's easy pushing probably man 20 or 30ks it's pretty windy and um yeah we're a bit buggered we don't we um having a feed this morning at the hut. We decided that I was gonna I was gonna push out up over those hills there, have a look for a deer, and um, Chad and Zane were gonna go and bush stalk down into the valleys out that way, just to get out of the cloud a bit. But I really want to check that valley out, so I'm gonna head up and over that valley there and see if I can find one. And the boys are going to do a bit of bush stalking, see if they can find one. So, um, yeah, we'll see how the day goes. Anyway, hopefully this cloud buggers off. We have a bit of visibility once I get over that hill, so. guys so I just came down from up there and my plan is because we saw two deer in here last night on these bits of clearing down in there I'm gonna stalk up that ridge there up to the tussock and then head right up there but hopefully if uh, my feelings right, I'm hoping the deer that Chad and Zane saw in here last night are camped somewhere on that ridge. And on my way up, hopefully I can get a crack at one. If not, then I'll carry on up the hill and see what's on the other side. So yeah. Oh. 
I might pick these up. Um, Shingle slide down here. I might put these down the side of it to get onto that one too. Yeah, that's where I want to go down there. Alright guys, so this is that ridge that we saw those deer on yesterday. Oh, the boys saw them anyway, I didn't I didn't get to see them but it's so open in here. I've got quite a good wind for going up here. It's going, it's going across the ridge left to right. And um Yeah it's the only thing is it's so open. I'll be so I'll be so lucky if I get one in here. But yeah, I'll carry on up. Hopefully, hopefully I can find those two from last night. And uh, if not, then I'll break out up into the tussock there and head up the hill a bit further. But yeah, time will tell, mate. Push on, be quiet, hope for the best. Sweet as. Alright, so I didn't end up finding those there on that ridge. So time to climb this hill. Get up a bit higher. And hopefully see one out in the tussock. Man, that's all I want on this trip. Just a nice veno out in the open. Get a bit of footage. Hopefully hit it with a bullet. Yeah. Hopefully the boys are doing alright over where they are in the bush. Can't believe how open that bush was in there. Man, that was nice. But yeah. Climb anyway. Get up there and have a look around. I love that view, it's great. Let's go. All right guys, so nearly at the top. It's just here. Let's see what we can see. Oh yeah, over there. Okay. Beautiful country.
Where are we? It's a big valley. I hope there's some deer in here. Not too many trees. But still, might be the young venom in here. See, what a hike. Man, I tell you, when you're doing those sorts of missions, the old camel pack is ideal. You don't have to keep taking your bag off to get a drink. Definitely a good bit of kit to have in your bag. Alright, I'm gonna carry on down this ridge. See if I can spot a deer somewhere. So I'll catch up soon, hopefully. Alright guys, so pretty much spent five hours glassing down into all these different little um, cracks in this valley. I started further up the valley, I was looking down into it, Just I moved down this end just to get a, a different angle on things and haven't seen any movement at all, no deer, no, like no animals. So um, yeah, my plan now, I'm going to pop back over into that valley and uh, bush, bush talk my way back to the hut for the uh, rest of the evening bit of a bummer because I really wanted to get one out in the open so I could film it but yeah I don't think that's going to happen so um, yeah we'll uh, carry on over the hill do a bit of bush talking hopefully Chad and Zana have uh, got one on their travels but we will see anyway we'll see how it goes it's not the end of the day yet stalk my way down through that valley there. See how we go anyway. Alright guys so I just dropped down up up there through there somewhere. There. And uh up there anyway. So I dropped down through there and I'm getting close to the trees now and straight away deer marks all over the place over here I've walked up there, walked up there I'm walking up that clay pad there probably more done on that clay so my plan is to stalk up, up through the bush up through there and hopefully get one that's if I can cross this river I don't even know if I can get across yet so yeah we'll um, venture down there and hopefully I can get across it otherwise I have to go all the way back up through there yeah, time will tell. Let's rock. Hoping that's a good sign. Alright guys, so stalked all the way back through the bush there. I'm uh, almost at the hut now, only about looking like a hundred meters or so, this is just up around the corner there. But um yeah, no go. Could not find them. There was uh a lot of deer prints around the place and old droppings but no no real fresh droppings that I could see so tomorrow up over that one I think I can go for an actual bush stalk for the whole day man come on right, we'll get there anyway see how the boys have, see how the boys have got on for the day hopefully they got something Take the pressure off a bit. Clouds rolling in again. But yeah, oh well. Yeah, we'll see, see what the morning brings anyway.
هست دیدن شنف رو بوشت و که تاپ شست و ویدیو اینه در هست رو بوده Wind for this ridge that I'm on. The bush is pretty nice and open too, so just hopefully, hopefully I can uh, bump into one before it sees me. It's a beautiful day in here. Be I'll carry on and see what we can come across. such a nice bush to hunt in. Tricky though because it's so open. You can get caught out pretty easy. I'm following all this sign that's up here. It's gotta be over here somewhere. Might just sit down and wait for a bit. Cause there's so much fresh droppings around and I've gotta be moving through here somewhere. Just such nice bush to hunt in. All right, see what happens. All right, guys. I think I cracked it. Somewhere down here. Stoked! Oh my god. Oh man, that was buzzy. <laughs> Holy crap! Yes. I was just sitting up there, probably sitting there for probably 10 minutes. And, uh, oh my god. <laughs> and, um, yeah, I could, I just like saw movement down through the trees. And I was thinking, what the hell is that? Yeah, there was two there, another one squealing at me. And, uh, yeah, I put the scope up, I was like, what? Some, what is that? And, um, yeah, two deer walk through. <laughs> oh, absolutely buzzing. There it is there anyway. It was a freaking hard shot through the trees. And the spiker. Poleaxed him. Oh, absolutely buzzing, man. Absolutely buzzing. That is freaking great. <laughs> oh yeah. There's so much sign around. I'm glad these I'm glad these things are small. Shit here. Drilled him through the neck. Cracked it. Such a beautiful animal too. <clears throat> man, that's great. Oh man, that makes me so happy. Hopefully the boys, hopefully the boys get one today too. Last day of the trip. Last day of the trip and we got one. So stoked. Buzzing. Cheers. Cheers buddy.
not impressed. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> and that is generally what you get to hear when you are hunting these things. Now I'll squeal and uh, catch you later. Not this time, buddy. Right, guys, so got them all ready uh, for the lug. Got the heart up there. It'll be afternoon tea when I get back. And uh, yeah, hopefully the brothers uh, smack on too. That'll be good. But um, yeah, shit, I'm a bit sunburnt. It's uh, not, not ideal. Yeah, cracked it. Still pumping, eh? Still buzzing about it. Man, yep, good times. Coming here to hunt the tops, we end up bush stalking for them. <laughs> oh, mate. Cracked it. Anyway, I'll uh, chuck all this on and head back to the hut. Cheers. Probably, uh, right, guys. In the way. Made it to the track. 440 down the hill I was when I got it, down that way. I tell you what, I'm glad it was a seeker, not a bloody red skin. I would have been blown coming up that hill. But uh, yeah, so got 2.2 k's to get back to the back to the hut, and then uh, yeah, crack a beer. I think, man, that'll taste bloody beautiful by the time I get back there. But check that out. What a beautiful day. Yeah, sweet as so I'll uh, carry on anyway. All right, guys. Finally back. That's down there. There's old Zeno cutting wood. Ciao, brother. Yeah. Get those bears ready, boy. Get those bears ready. I think he can't hear me. <laughs> anyway, time to head back down there, sweet ass. Where you on, brother? Nice. That's what they look like? Yeah. How do you fellas get on? Oh, true. Right guys, so it's the last day of the last day of the trip today. Getting picked up in a minute. We uh clean the hut nice and nice and tidy for the next crew. Nice hut that fireplace rules man. Left a bit of firewood there for the next people, bit of kindling, get the fire started. Yeah. Beautiful hut that one. Go to another one next time though. And uh, yeah, just about to grab the old Veno. So uh, that's up here. Grab that, take it back down to the helipad, which is down there. And then uh, we're out of here. So yeah, had a good, uh, good, uh, good few days in here. Hard hunting up in the tops. Didn't see any deer. Ended up bush talking, and uh, that's where the venos were. So yeah, good times. Um, yeah, well, see you on the next one, I think. Cheers. <laughs> Ready to rock, are you? Get the hell out of here. Yeah, mate. Classic.